Hey guys, welcome back to Tony's How To's. In this video, I'll be showing you how to download Windows 10 on USB. But before we start, hurry up and check all the software just under this video. So let's get started. This is going to be set for you to download Windows 10 on your USB and use it as a installer or a way for you to install Windows 10. Well, it's fairly easy. So the first thing they want to do here is you want to open up any browser that you have and you want to search for the following, which is going to be download Windows 10. Now, from here, we need to look for the official web page for Microsoft. So you need to get this from the official page from Microsoft, which is www.microsoft.com. Now, click on the option or link that says download Windows 10, this image or ISO file. Go ahead and click on it. Now, from here, what we need to do is we just need to wait for this to boot up. And what we need to do here is we need to choose the option here that says create Windows 10 installation media, which in this case, we need to click on download now. Now, the installation media here actually allows us to uh, install Windows or the installer for Windows on our USB. Now, since we've downloaded it, let's go open up this folder here. And what we need to do is we need to open up the .exe file. Let's go and open it up. Now, it will ask you a few uh, notifications here or permission. Just click on yes here to confirm. And you should be able to see the installation media here. So it's going to first start booting or start setting it up first. So in this case, it might take a few minutes or a few seconds, depending on the speed of your PC. But for now, let's just wait for this to boot up or get ready. Now, it's going to give you the uh, option for Microsoft software license and terms here. You could go ahead and read it through all of them if you want. But for now, let's go and click on accept. Now, from here, it's going to start getting ready first again. So let's just wait for it. Now, here we have two options. So you have the upgrade this PC now or create installation media. Now, just to explain to you, the upgrade this PC now option actually allows you to upgrade your current PC. Like, for example, if you have a lower or a uh, older um, Windows on your PC, you could update, upgrade this into Windows 10. But since we want to create an installer on a USB, we want to click on the create installation media, USB, USB flash drive, DVD, ISO file for another PC. Let's go ahead and click on this one and click on next. Now from here, what we need to do, it's going to uh, ask us the language, architecture, and edition. Now, in this case, you could go ahead and use the recommended options for this PC. But if you disable this one, you could uh, basically select what is the architecture. Like, for example, we have 32, we have 64-bit here, we have the Windows 10 edition, and the language for it. But we want to use the recommended options here and click on Next. Now, from here, we have two options again. We have USB flash drive, which in this case, your USB needs at least 8 gigabyte of storage. And you also, or you could also use the ISO file option here. Now, in this case, you could burn this into a DVD, but since we want to use a USB drive, let's go and use the, uh, choose USB flash drive here and click on X. Now, from here, it's going to ask us what drive or what USB we are or what do we want to use. So maybe I want to use this one. Let's go and select this one and click on next. Now, by the way, if you've just reinserted a drive, you can go and click on refresh drive list here. And again, you can go ahead and choose your USB drive. In this case, let's click on next. Now, from here, it's going to start preparing your drive here. And one more thing that I need you to uh, take note here is you need to make sure that your USB does not contain any personal files. Now, if you have like personal files in stored or uh, in it, you might want to move this somewhere so that you won't lose those or access on those files. Because again, it will reformat your USB and you will lose access on your specific uh uh, files that you've added on your USB. But in this case, this might take an hour or 30 minutes depending on the speed of your PC. But in this case, just wait for this one to complete. Now, once it's done, this is what it's going to look like. It's going to say your USB flash drive is ready. So just click on finish. And from here, it's through, it's going to start cleaning up the process or the Windows 10 web setup here. But once you're done, what you need to do is you just need to eject it. So at the bottom right of your screen, go ahead and click on the show hidden icons. Go ahead and right click on the save the remove hardware. And from here, you should be able to see pop up here that says eject USB disk. Let's go ahead and eject this one. And from here on, you can go ahead and start using this to your other PC or your other setup to install Windows 10. Now, in this case, that's about it. So, if you found this video helpful, hit the like and subscribe button and watch our next video.